Hey guys, in this video we have a work from home job that pays you to do research online and also use a little bit of AI. And it's hiring right now at around $34 per hour estimated. It's at a company called Stone Press and this allows companies to get the highest quality B2B leads. And for this particular job, it's the freelance content producer and researcher. It's available in the United States, it's a contract position. And for this particular job, they are looking for someone to basically create content, but you're going to do mostly research and you're also going to learn how to use AI and have AI do a lot of the content production for you. And then about 10% of the time you might do some editing or actual writing yourself. So most of the job is research, automated content through AI, and then about 10% of the time you'll do a little bit of editing and writing yourself. So your responsibilities include conduct market and brand based research to figure out what really matters about each type of software, what separates brands from each other and what readers need to know to choose the best software for them. You aren't expected to do full software testing, but you will be required to dig deep enough to figure out what matters most and verify every claim you make. You will produce fast first drafts based on what you find. They have a detailed step-by-step -step process that leverages AI writing tools to help you turn your research into a rough draft as efficiently as possible. So they already have some templates and maybe some prompts that you'll use with AI like ChatGPT or something like that to help, it, help you know exactly what to type in to help AI start creating a rough draft. You will proofread AI outputs and ensure they are 100% factual before passing the draft to the editor and use research you've done previously to compare brands head to head for different use cases, create top lists centered around specific audiences, and put together other types of content that actually help people make the best decisions for their businesses. To tell if you'll be a great fit for this job, you need to be happy to focus exclusively on B2B software, including CRMs, project management tools, web hosting, and HR software, to name a few. You're comfortable moving very fast and have no problem adapting to change. You have high learning velocity and can get the gist of just about anything in a matter of minutes. You don't mind researching 50 plus different brands in the same category before moving on to something else. You're interested in business software and helping people find the best tools. You have a knack for market analysis. You research heavily before you buy anything and you know how to cut through the noise online to find what really matters. Notice how they say a knack for market analysis, but not necessarily job wise. They're talking more about you research heavily before you buy anything. So they're talking about market analysis as a consumer and not as somebody who's been an employee and had to do that for their job. Also, you are excited about the potential of high quality AI content creation. You have experience using AI based tools to produce blog posts or reviews and aren't afraid to experiment to get the outputs you want. So the only thing they even mention in regards to um, AI and experience or anything like that has to do with have you created reviews or posts or anything like that with ChatGPT or BARD or Perplexity AI and things like that before. And these can be things that you can do some YouTube videos that will show you kind of how these work. You can create some things with these and maybe just show people in the application that you know how to use them. But I don't see a lot in terms of having to have a lot of professional experience creating content or doing much of anything related to this job. And they also don't seem to require a college degree or anything like that either. As far as what it's like to work at Stone Press, they don't have a lot of reviews yet and they have a Glassdoor page. It says they're headquartered in Seattle, Washington and the United States. But other than that, you don't really have a lot to go on yet. They seem to be a fairly new company. But as far as how much a content producer typically makes, typically just on average, if you took a US based estimate for all years of experience, it would be around $71,000 per year, which is right around $34 per hour. So hopefully this was interesting. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell if you want more daily work from home opportunities like these. Click the link in the video description if you want to go to this job posting and learn more. And I'll see you in the next video.